Here's the AppSlayer attribution model in 60 seconds. So if we fast forward here to this uh, image that AppSlayer provides, it's very simple. Now, a user may click uh, on an ad or they may view the ad, let's say a Facebook ad or Google ad. Then they go to the App Store and the App Store is effectively like a black box. So users arrive to it uh, and there's a, not a lot of connection between the, the activity that happened before they arrive at the App Store, clicking the ad, and then what might happen after, which is install on the app. So when they first install the app in the very first launch, this is when AppSlider really kind of kicks in. And you can now, AppSlider can make start to make determinations and say, you know, this install came from Facebook. This install came from Google. Now to do this, AppSlider has to be integrated properly. There has to be integrations with the ad networks themselves, Facebook, Google, and so forth. And all this data has to flow. Uh, now, after the install, there can be other events. Uh, there can be reinstallations. There can be uninstallations, on uh, account creations, anything like that. But this is why AppSlider kind of exists to fill in this gap 